Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Funky Steve's Medinas. So today we're sitting at Fu Chao. We shifted planets again between episodes. Uh, it's probably good. One of the things I don't like is watching the waiting for the the uh, travel to finish. But uh, we moved from not Platea, from, uh, not from there. Ah, crap! I can't even remember where we moved from. From Keck, right? We were at Keck, and we moved all the way up here um, to Fu Chao. It was only a 14-day trip, which is good. So we are here now. Uh, I pulled off one of those really, really easy missions. It was like a million sea bills or 900 and something thousand sea bills. So I pulled one of those off. So we have some sea bills in the bank. So we're clear for our financial statement, uh, and we're start clear to start working on the um, Victor when we get a chance. So we're going to take, first thing, we're going to just jump right in today. Well, not just jumping right in, but we're close enough. Uh, we're going to do a capture production mission here. Good sea bill payout, good salvage, four skulls. So let's just go in and get this sucker done. Uh, we're going to go full salvage, of course. And, but I'm bum. We're going to uh, run this lance, I think. Uh, I was considering bringing the Jager mech for this, uh, our overheating mech, but I'm thinking because it's a four skull, I think I want something a little heavier, bring in the Victor. Uh, we definitely need the Hunchback as our punch bot. Uh, I'm going to need that for sure. So let's deploy our lance here and get this sucker done. Mm, yeah, you say that, Darius, but we'll be fine. Okay, here we go. Nice cold environment. Definitely will favor us, I think. Um, right. Time to earn our money. So we got two guys down here. I'm receiving you. Acknowledged. I think I'm gonna run this differently than I ran it in the, in the past. Waiting for orders. All right, Rock. Commander. How far can you go? Got it. So getting this light engine in the Victor, I think, is definitely way more priority over than the Emil near. Mjolnir's firepower is nice now. Um, when we hit up the clans, would we'll definitely be changing it slightly, but it'd um, be nice to be able to get some clan ERPPCs. Okay, so we got a guy down here, catapult 65 ton, catapult 65 ton, catapult 65 ton, and catapult 65 ton. Oh, shut up, Darius. Well, guys, I mean, we talked about running a Lance of Catapults, so we'll definitely be getting some parts here. Okay. That's the double. These guys all look the same. 65s, right? So the two missile systems, two lasers, and a bunch of melee bits. 83, 70, same. Well, this is 87, 73, 83. This guy's in the woods, that's why. This guy's in the open. So let's put the t -Semp on this guy and the PPC. See if we can blow this guy out of the water. They got jump jets. Gonna need more than that to stop us, guys. Now, do we want to we want to go direct line of sight here? I think. But we don't want to be in their direct line of sight. So let's. Ah oh, man. Fifty one, seventy five. Make sure we're turned to receive fire from the front. 
And let's dump everything into this guy. So they got two extended long range missile 15s, two light PPCs, melee and death from above. Right, that would make sense because they jump jets. So there you go guys. Um, this is the one thing I wasn't really sure about, the two whites at the bottom, but it is death from above that this is the second one. That's good to know. It's been a really long time since I've seen a mech do death from above, so... The last time I saw a mech do death from above, it hit my upper body, destroyed my head, and killed the mech pilot. It was a wolverine. A nasty wolverine. Crap. Well, at least he's splitting fire. Where are you going, buddy? Oh, you're coming to be seen. Okay. I think I want to try and grab one of these chassis. If we can get four parts of these guys, which we should, there's four mechs, so definitely want to try and do that. Hmm. I can't sprint. Uh, I don't have any way to get stable again. Alright, we're going to fire on this guy. Fire everything. Okay, nice head hit. Alright, Steve. Time to prove your metal. Everything on this guy. Firing. Um, we need to keep moving, so let's go after this guy. Don't really care about salvage off these guys. We want the four mech parts for sure. That's the guy up on the hill. He's only hitting for one, though. I wonder why that is. Let's move down here. I'm going to split fire, I think, between this guy. I want to knock him down and this guy. Uh, B is going to take... Hmm... The two fifteens, I think. That's fire. Split fire. Confirm. Okay, he's going down. That should make him unstable now. Scar to yep. Okay. So that guy's got pulse lasers. Yeah, good luck with that guy. Light damage, Commander. Yes, Commander. Okay, Rhino, once again we gotta walk. Let's move into here. Copy that. Uh I think I wanna split fire again. I know I shouldn't do this, but I'm going to. Uh between this guy and this guy. B um It's gonna take this. We're gonna hope for a head hit and we're gonna fire. Okay, nice. Ah, no head hit. It's panicking though. Okay, so those guys have got a wide variety of loadouts. The catapult 65. That's the C2. Okay. Maybe it's just showing me that as... Because it... 
Oh, we have no idea what it is. That guy's got two wounds. Yeah, I think it just shows us that because we have no idea what it is. So he's got two ballistic hard points. Steve, let's get up in the trees here, buddy. Uh, we're going to split fire again between you and you. And... Like that. And fire. Maybe we can encourage this guy to bail out. Or we could destroy his torso and that would be it for that. And we could destroy the engine on that guy too. I totally meant to do that, just in case you were wondering. Light damage. Holding firm. I'm here. Okay guys, let's make this guy unstable first. And um just gonna fire. Let's nab this base while we're at it. I have a feeling that we're going to get reinforcements, so I don't want to cross the river just yet. I want to know what we're dealing with first. So let's fire on this guy. Uh, pretty good chances. That hit good. He's hanging on. Not for long, though. Wow. Oh, those v those are VSPLs, I guess. My armor's getting stripped off. I can see that. Standing by. Let's push these guys a little bit. Confirmed. And dump everything straight into this guy's Confirmed. face. Hanging in there. Hanging in there. Hmm. How do I hit? Oh, here we go. It's multi target. And. 3 to B, 1 to A. Actually, we'll put 2 on A. And fire. Wow, Steve's hogging all the kills here. Because he shoots last, that's why. Of course you do. We know what they are. Fulcrum, Fulcrum, Black Knight. Okay, Rock, let's not hang out there. Ugh. Let's do this. Roger. Black Knight and Orion, nice. That's some good parts if we can get some. Take pot shots. Okay, that uh, PPC is working really, really well. This guy's deciding to close, that's fine. The SPLs have a better chance to hit, but his missiles won't. Which is probably why he's gonna fire across the river. No. Nope. Yep. Yes, Commander. Let's make sure our back's clear first. Affirmative. This guy's taking everything to the face. We got. Oh, nice shooting, man. Got seven chevrons of evasion. The hell. Waiting for orders. Just back up. Let's give this guy everything to the face. Can't afford to monkey around with this guy anymore. Reporting critical hit. 
We'll finish him up here in the next turn, or the next round, with Steve. Same round, next unit to go, that is. So he's got a large pulse. And their vehicles. Are they actually moving? Well. Damage is minor. Yeah, but he's got a tag on you, buddy. Another fulcrum. Wait, what's up the first? Serms, I guess, eh? Yeah, two fulcrums. Alright, Steve. I'm sure our side is turned. And we'll dump everything into this guy's face. Um, just gonna fire it. Ultra light engines, guys, don't do it. I'm here. Let's get started. Um, Move order received. Thirty-eight. Thirty-eight. Thirty-two. Thirty-two. Let's go against the Black Knight. And fire everything. I think the Black Knight's got heavier armor than the Orion usually. Get some of that stripped away. Okay. I need to bring Rocky back. All right, just gonna do that. Let's see what they do. Gonna take a little bit of damage here and there. Not that worried. I think we'll make a firing line right here. Okay, so he does see us up here. Order. It's all right, buddy. We see you too. Moving out. Twenty-six, eighteen, forty-four, eighteen. Let's fire on this guy. Okay, making sure we're in the trees. 2332. Same. So we're gonna go go gonna go on the black knight. And fire. Okay, one hit, not bad. Not bad. Commander. Um gonna reserve Rocky. I know we're getting hesitation minuses here, but just bear with me for a second. I really want to capitalize on this next turn. Um, let's reserve again. Yeah, they can't really, they don't really sense us back here. Something I thought was going to happen. I'm hoping our hesitation bonus isn't too big. 
or hesitation negative, I guess. Come on, Orion. Okay, we waited them out. Uh, we're gonna reserve it right now for a second. Okay, Rocky, let's do this. Uh, let's get in here. No shooting. Oh no, we got shooting. All right, uh, Black Knight, sixty-one fifty-five, seventy-three fifty-five, seventy-three fifty-five, sixty-seven. So let's go after the Orion. And fire. Receiving you. Copy that. Can we get more than we can? So we're gonna multi target Ryan and vehicle and fire. I copy. I'm receiving you. Confirmed. And everything straight into this guy's face. For an alpha Moving in a little bit closer with Steve. If he saw crap, we didn't get to a position where it was good enough. Don't have any idea what the armor's like on these guys. So they've got one support, one missile, one laser. Two laser, one support, and one missile. Do I want to kill this guy or do I want to try and knock the Orion down? Let's not waste our chance to hit. Let's go against the vehicle. Maybe we can take it out. Two of them hit an invisible wall. Yes, Commander. Position confirmed. Locked on for physical attack. Come on. Nice. Who's going next here? He's not quite unstable yet, though. Yeah, it's them shooting. I knew it. Damage minimal. Was it one? I think it was one of the vehicles. Come on thinking about it. Yeah, it was. Yes, Commander. Coordinates received. See if we can dump this Orion on the ground. Uh, fire with everything. Yes, Commander. Okay, moving forward. Follow up with everything again on the Orion. Yep. Nice. Oh, he's still standing. Nice try. Okay. Probably a vehicle going again. Just trying to figure out what it's going to do here. If I was this vehicle, I'd move back here. Find out what he's doing. Come on. Nope. Get that two square movement in. 70. Yeah, it's still the best. Orion it is. Let's do this. Oh, 
Oh, he's gonna melee. No. Got yeah, point blank fire. Probably a good thing. Well, for him anyway, not for me. Internal structure damage. Yeah, we're getting out of here. Commander. That should hopefully hide you enough from direct fire. Uh, let's move to the side of the Orion. And hammer him hard. So we're going to fire everything. Maybe we can take that left arm. Nope. Sure as hell make him unsteady though. Alright, what are they doing? It's one of the vehicles again. Probably this guy here. Yep. Not sure why the vehicles are taking longer to calculate. Now he's got to figure out where he's going. Maybe they're doing sensor checks against my units back here. That's a possibility. Yeah, you can see my chevron, or my uh, outline. Let's see if we can put that Orion on his ass. And firing. Okay, so he's got two wounds now. Not quite close enough with the LMGs. Here comes the other fulcrum. So let's see what it's doing. Probably moving back forward again. Don't hear him. Come on, buddy. There you are. Okay. Ready for orders. Let's just move forward. Let's take advantage of this while we got it. Try for a headshot. Probably won't get it. Ah, eh, just fire. Some well, at least we hit the arm. This guy doesn't have much left. I think the AC is in the uh, right torso. Alright Rocky, um... This guy is really hurt so he's going to be going at the end of the turn. I know this looks foolish, but it's not. We're going to take this guy on. Location confirmed. Okay, another vehicle moving here. Really slows the turns down with these vehicles. Okay, you're shooting on the right guy. Right guy for us, wrong guy for them. To me that's a no-brainer with these vehicles, you just roll behind this guy and shoot him in the back, but... Not for the AI. Oh, 
Although I will, ha I will say though, um, the AI is actually a lot smarter than most people give them credit for. Uh, and it's only simply because they've, um, whenever you move in, they move back, right? So if you've got a mech in their midst, they try and stay so that this guy's between us and them. At least that's been my experience anyway. Yeah, let's fire this. Come on. Shooting this vehicle, not that one. Okay, the other vehicle moving. I think we'll if that Orion goes down this turn, we're gonna start we're gonna start our stompy stompy robot moves and start crushing these guys. These guys just really quite haven't been in a position to be able to do that yet. Yeah, see they're staying with their back back here. Okay, Orion's all yours. See if you can put his ass on the ground. Firing. Yep, going down again. He's giving up. Don't blame you. Do not blame you at all, buddy. Okay, Warlord's back. Yeah, it's really going to be the Black Knight. Taking it. Firing. Nicely done. Enemy mech. Critical damage detected. Yeah, not much you can really do. Yes, Commander. Okay, time for Stompy Stompy Robots. Let's do this. On it. Locked on for physical attack. Fine, finish him up. Nice. Yeah, I'm definitely liking that better than the LBX. Does far less stability damage, but um, definitely does way more physical damage. Uh, we're almost out of LRMs. So let's do something. Leave the high damage LRM on. Um, that's Warlord this, confirm, offensive push on this guy, and see if we can hit this arm. Okay, nice. Okay, Steve, let's make him unstable. Firing. Or we can just kill them too, that works. Enemy mech destroyed. So I'm thinking order of the day for the catapult is trying to find some way to squeak another ton of ammo in there. If these were if these guys were mechs, we would be out of ammo. Either that or find a way to put a backup system in there. ER, any kind of ER lasers would be good, I think. Something like maybe a couple of ER mediums or uh, later on a couple of ER, uh, clan ERs. Alright, see if we can hit this guy. Aye, aye. See, we're still okay ammo wise here. But we're set up for about 15 turns of firing, that's why. Catapults around 10 turns of firing. Order. Might be able to finish this fast here. Is that green? That's green. Are we green? We're green. 147, not bad. Oh, you missed this. Okay. I'm here. All right. 60 rounds left, eh? Let's fire them all. 
I might get that side. There we go. Well, that wasn't too bad. Four catapult parts. Mission six. Okay, 315,000, which should probably cover our repairs here. And the Hunchback did take some inter- Oh, he's down to seven. We almost lost the T-Simp. That would have made our decision for us. We could have uh, put in a um, Haywire EMP in the, in the talons and the legs. We'll make sure we get that repaired though. Okay, so I'm thinking we're going to take catapult parts. C2s, C21s, heavy fire support, two extended LRM 15s with four tons of ammo backed up by two light PPCs, and this is just what? Two LB2X. I'm just thinking whichever one we get. I'm just hoping we get some salvage out of it. So 260 engine. This one is a 260. C22 is what? Medium varial speed pulse lasers. Two extended range. Enhanced LRM15s. These enhanced or yeah oh extended LRM 15s. What's the difference between extended and enhanced? Perhaps damage. Interesting. Okay, ELRMs five damage times fifteen. That's probably what the enhanced version is. This is the extended. Yeah, I don't think there's really anything down here. Um, I want to, yeah, there's so much good stuff though, but I think I want to guarantee that mech. Uh, let's take the C21. Well, C21 is what, extended or enhanced? Two light PPCs. Extended. That's what these are, right? Yeah, so let's take the extended version. I mean, we got like five parts of an Orion, too. Uh, God, do we take a 75 tonner? I think so. What are the hard points on this guy? Two ballistic, four missile, four laser. It's the same with this one. C2 is the same. God, what a choice. We could take three parts of an Orion, one part of a catapult. Multi-role brawler. Uh, yeah. Let's do that. Let's take the C21. We got two of those already. And let's hope for the best, guys. One, two, three Black Knight parts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven catapult parts. Oh my god. We just picked up two heavy mechs, guys. All right, a lot of stuff changing hands. There's the Orion K. And C1M. How do we get... Oh, crap. Alright, 100,000 for repairs. Not too bad. How do we get the C1? What? How 
How did we get to C1? Ah, no fusion core. Oh, well, cooling pod. 523,000 to fix this guy. Let's leave him for now. Milk runs. We need engines too. Uh, let's check this guy. It looks like he's lost everything. Alright, where's our hard points on this guy? So, we got a lower arm and a medium laser off this guy. Um, two lasers and... Okay, we got support points in each, arms, which is, each arm, which is good. If we can find a nice big-ass core for this guy. Two missile systems. Ballistic. This could be MMLs. These can be pirate medium lasers. And then just all damage stuff in a big ass core with a mask. I'm thinking that's what we're going to do. Just to get this guy repaired though, it's 728,000. Um, we're going to hold off because I want to fix the um, Victor first. But definitely going to need some milk runs now. So that is the huge change, I think, with this new version of Battletech, is the extended mech bay costs. Keep that in mind when you're playing. Uh, you're going to need to do milk runs for sure. Absolute sure. Um, without them, there's no way you're going to uh, survive things here. Um, let's bring the catapult up. Let's bring the mule near up. And I'll probably pull a milk run offline before the end of the month. Uh, try and get some more cash here. Uh, but I'm going to end the episode here today. I think getting two heavy mechs and a four skull mission was actually really good. Um, yeah, I think that turned out really, really great. Uh, I was glad to see, well, at first it had me worried there was four catapults, but then I realized it didn't have that many missiles, so it wasn't that bad. Um, but yeah, so if you liked the episode, drop a like. If you got any suggestions for the Orion or the catapult, uh, please fill them in the uh, comment section down below. I'm thinking we could load up that catapult with uh, MMLs. Um, we'll see how it goes, I don't know. Uh, and then the Orion, I think we can make it into a heavy brawler and shift the hunchback down to just a regular mech again. Uh, I think probably that's what we'll end up doing, but we need a big core first, so we'll have to go and find one of those. Hopefully in one of my milk run missions I can find something. Um, but yeah, so uh, if, any, if you got any suggestions, drop it in the comment section down below. And until next time, we'll see you later.